So you just seen my brand new Origami Looper logo for my channel and I'm not sure if I'll use it for every single page of mine but we'll get to that. So the idea was, if you know, if you don't already know, Looper is the face of my channel. He's the face of nearly every single page I have and have made. Um, he is the face of Fearless Flourish. When people think of Fearless Flourish, I want Looper to pop into their head first right away, which is so nice of a thought. And I was mentioning this to my friend Joe as well, and he absolutely loved that idea as well. So that's why I always try and include him in everything I do. So when people think of Fearless Flourish, I want them to think of Looper, Origami, and then me. So he is the idea and the inspiration behind this new logo, which you've just seen there. I can't actually remember if I just said that or not, but anyway. So the idea that I had in mind before I got it made was, let me just draw an example, it's going to be a really bad picture of a cat head. So just imagine this is a perfect cat head, which is a perfect circle as always, we have the ears. Yeah, so, looper's face, and then we will have some sort of line going down like that. Now. Looper's face will be in the polygon or polygonal effect, which you'll see in a second. Um, basically that idea. Now, the reason I have this line here is because the right hand side will be in colour and that will match his colours to his face. Which will have different shades of oranges, light oranges, dark oranges, some white. Um, yeah, and the left hand side will be white, clear white, light grey, with lines going all around it, same as this but obviously not coloured, and then my name somewhere, or down the side, or even up top. Now, because I am not a graphics designer, I cannot create this on my own, I could, but it wouldn't be anywhere as good as you would see like actual designers make. So, over the past couple of weeks, there's been videos popping up on my YouTube page called the, uh, About Fiverr, the website Fiverr, where people pay people to finish a design or create an animation or something like that. So I thought, I'm going to try it. And then I went on Fiverr, typed in origami, and lots of people popped up. Basically, it's peep, it's where you can pay someone to do work for you. Obviously find people that are graphic designers or are trained in this industry that they can make it for you. So I found someone and it's really cheap as well. The actual design cost about £6 in total and like £1 extra for, for VAT anyway. So it's, it's really, really cheap. But obviously people charge different, but probably the same quality for most. Anyway, I found someone, I messaged them, I first I bought it and then I typed up everything I wanted. I wanted Looper's face, I wanted it halved, I wanted this side coloured, this side white, my name somewhere on the page, or on the on the picture, and then they sent it, they read it, then they made it, and then this is what they gave. Ta-da! Now I've already shown this, I think, on my Instagram. No, I don't think I've shown it on my Instagram. Not on my pages yet. I've shown it on my community page. Yeah, I think that's the only place, that, place I've actually shown this. It's also my picture on my Instagram as well, if you've not already seen it. So this is the idea that came behind. Now, the, the right side isn't as dark as this, because when I print it on the shiny paper, on the highest quality, it comes out slightly darker, so I may, may I might adjust that on editing as well if I need to. Pardon me. But this is the actual finished design. Now I also have the PNG, so I can put it on any background I want. I didn't. They also offer where you can buy the. I think it's called the vector files, but I don't have the actual program to use this. So I don't think I really need it, but again, 
I'm thinking about putting this on a business card and then getting a business card custom made because when I was at the convention last year my friend Ryan had business cards which were super cool and that gave me the idea to try and do my own so this is a good starting point for that so thank, thank you Ryan if you're watching for your business cards which are really neat as well uh, I'm definitely going to try and make my own hopefully I'll have some ready for this convention if not, whatever but this is a good starting point so we have, first of all Looper's face or near enough again that right hand side is coloured I may change the green I'm not too sure on the green but again, tell me what you think the left hand side is perfect um, we have the name underneath and what's cool is the whiskers go over the name which I didn't even think about it's quite tricky when people when, when you're trying to tell someone what you would like it's impossible to try and think of all the ideas I would never have thought to put the whiskers over the name which really really suits it in my eyes I absolutely love that and again we have the, the clear white and well not whiteish. Yeah, I can I can again I can I can uh, change this if I want to make it lighter or darker. I'm trying to get close here. So we have all those different shades of whites and greys on the left hand side. And there's lines going on in between which represent the origami and again the coloured side. So Looper, thank you so much for being the face of my channel and folding all the models for me. I do all the business stuff, like video editing and uploading and recording, where Looper, as you know, is the folder. He does all the folding, and if you didn't already know, paws are a thousand times better than folding, so I'm looking to find a doctor to amputate my hands to get me paws so I can fold just like him. So that is the that is where the idea came from and how I went about creating it. So please let me know in the comments what you think about this design. It honestly, it, it makes the... Uh, what was I going to say? I don't know. I, I have no idea what I was going to say there. But anyway, let me know what you think in the comments. And that is it.